Welcome back to our course on PowerPoint 2013. In this section I'd like to give you a quick overview of how you can customize the status bar. We looked at the status bar earlier in the course and at the moment the status bar here at the bottom of the screen has pretty much the default information displayed on it. So first of all let me right click on the status bar and what you see is a list of all of the available contents for the status bar and as you can see almost everything is ticked which means that in theory it's shown on the status bar. In practice several things are not shown. Let's start with one or two of the ones that are. Let's start at the top. The view indicator, slide 3 of 4. Well you can see that the first item on the status bar says slide 3 of 4 which says that we've currently selected the third slide out of a total of four in a presentation. One thing that's not shown is the theme of this presentation and if I want to show something that's not shown so I've got something that's not ticked all I need to do is click on it and now it appears and you can see the theme is indeed celestial. If I don't need to show that then again click it to unshow it. The next one, number of authors editing, I can't actually see anything related to that and the reason is when something is blank or not relevant, so in this case because there is only one person with this presentation open, then nothing appears. Similarly, if I look a bit further down the list, I've got three items here together, signatures, information policy and permissions. All of these features are actually off you can see on the right where all three of them say off so even though they're ticked they don't appear because the features themselves are switched off and information about their status is not available whereas if I go back up to language which is English United States and click that of course I'll remove that from its display on the status bar and then I can tick it back on again so that's pretty much how it works. Anything that's ticked in theory is shown in the status bar but things where a particular feature is switched off or is not relevant to the current situation will actually not appear on the status bar anyway. So that explains why you've got an awful lot more ticks on this list than you have items on the status bar at the moment. That's all you need to know about the status bar for now. I'll see you in the next section.